one bolt. I can't remember what the term for it is. Anyway, uh, term, but the, uh, or, the order of execution is when I say boss. So that's when you actually did like action. So, shoulder, arms, and you lift up and you rest it with the lock plate the other way around. Like that. With the lock plate facing facing forward. Yep, very good. Order, arms. And you bring the weapon back down again to where it was. Got it. And resting on the front. Shoulder, arms. Okay. Now I'm going to do, because it's raining, we're going to teach secure arms. So secure, you take the neck of the, uh, of the weapon, arms, and you actually reach up and you pivot it underneath your arm so that you can keep it underneath. Shoulder, arms. Up. Okay, when I say present, lock facing forward, so actually I'll stand on Present, arm. Oh. Yeah, because that hits you in the guts. Yeah. You just turn. Oh, you, you hold that at the, at the neck. Oh, right. Yep, very good. Yeah, because yeah, if you're in a combat situation, you don't want to... Like that. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Yeah. It's a three-step process. Yeah. You can turn it up with your hand, and the weapon facing straight up with your hand. You can do it with other arms. Now, you're right, you're right, you're right. Yeah. 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 Glad this isn't recording yet. <laughs> Oh, sorry, it is. That's alright. You have to turn it off. You have to make it dead, Johnny. Yeah. You turn that in its place. Yeah. And you hold it, yep. Yep. And you bring it up. There. Yeah, so yeah, you just have to... That feels right, yeah. Yep, that's it. And you kind of have your hand close to the front of the lock, so you're in front of the trigger guard. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yes. And then... And then as you, you actually take a step back, see that? Yeah. Foot? Yep. And you kind of drop it down. And it, it's actually, sometimes in the manuals, it's almost like their hands and their arms. And it's dead straight like that. Mm. It's very low. Um, yeah, anyway. All right. That's present on. Yeah. I need the one that I could look at. Shoulder. Oh. Ah. That was a hundred bucks, that one. Yep. Um, some got stick with them. Order. Ah. So when you take to go this quarter arm, which will eventually happen, um, be careful about how you grab that. Because if you grab it,
It's basically seized in the center of the sprite, um, and it's actually at a slant. You've got the muzzle uh, almost directly abreast from you, or you know, like across your shoulders, depending on what sort of weapon you have. And yeah, that's how you go in advance. Yeah, this is a bit. Yeah, yeah, with the cavalry carbine, it's a bit different. Um, and then shoulder, you actually lift it slightly. Arms, and then you take it back to the, so many bloody license the, uh, to the shoulder. Okay, you might want to free. Now, that's your military room. When you're actually uh, advancing on the charge, they actually yes. go running in like Sorry, this. One. They actually take something like oh, four arms, and you only really the other two are at it when you're pretty much on top of them. Um, and also good shouts. Yeah. Uh, Hunting um, license is the problem with weapon like this is the cross your mind with the front. So the reason is, is so we'll go to port arms. It's very simple in the area and just straight across and just kind of holding it out in front of you. Yep. And that is how the whole regiment actually advances. Um, or oh, other way around with a lock plate. Hey, uh, brought. So, and then your other hand supports, yep, yep, and then you just bring it, bring it somewhere um, across, all right? Then they've got to put that in. Lift, sink, right, take it Yes, we'll give it that. We'll try that one again, uh, just to use a bit of repetition. Shoulder, arms, port, arms. And get a bit of yeah, there you go, very good. That's a very good, that's a very good way to you know, advance on the bike position. Bring it down, especially if you've got a bayonet. Um, a game, you know, it's, a, it's a very handy way. Whereas, and I you realize this once you get the manual, running like this, it's easy to trip and you can hold down. Well, this is this is um, so, you know, that's why they things very um, make a lot of sense. Yeah, exactly. When you start looking at you, like, not see what they want. They're sure to be safe, you know, and do it in a proper way. Um, and no surprise that their bayonets actually like uh, they actually bend slightly away from the muzzle. That's not because of bullets. That's because when you are loading, you the bayonets on that side, and that way it's pointing the opposite way that you are handed. That being said, I read of a uh, Royal Marine on HMS Menelaus that actually held his hand on the um, during training, so this will happen. But you know, you have to be all things we said being forced to blow the fire as well as the same day. Um, but that just a bit of um, original. I guess it's their attitude for that. Um, Alright, so we might as well go through the uh, loading. I haven't been a public service, I've seen it. Alright, so we're going to be doing it. We're going to go through it. Yeah, basically, the, the yeah. way that soldiers were taught, they would drill day and night. <laughs> All right. Uh, I've done 15 years judo. Okay. The mind is the end of the need for our mission. Order. Ah. Kind of important to them to get. Now. Um, so yeah, it's like it's needs to say. Okay. okay. Um, now, because hair to load, I believe it is. Tape up, and you have your hands near, and you basically, as often as you leave it out of cartridge boxes, we've actually got a very annoying little button that makes it very difficult to load uh, or to open our cartridge. So, first thing you do when you take up your, your weapon, so you prepare to load, you still prepare to load, and then you pull it back to half cock. Yeah. Alright, so you're at the half cock. It's not going to go anywhere, very safe. And you have your hand, but you don't get the handle cartridge. Right. So your hand is just, you've just undone your cartridge box, you're at the, you're also ready to handle. Handle cartridge! So you reach in, grab your cartridge, bring it up to your mouth, and you've got the end, the end in, your, in your teeth. Six months Okay. Uh, I, think it's, I think it's just prime, as a matter of fact. Is that just one cartridge? Prime! Tear. And you close the prison. Okay. Um, um, charge cartridge. Yes. Yeah. Oh, it's happy about it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Uh, it's between the feet, isn't it? Come up back. The, the French, French go all the way back. French go all the way back. French, French also takes a step back. We yeah. just stand straight on, and I'm pretty sure it was like that. Okay, we'll go with that one. That's fine. Um, okay, and you, uh, and you seize the end of your rammer. 
with Ramrod, actually, the period was the one look at it. Now, Ram down, Cartridge. What is it? Draw Ramrod. Okay. Oh, yes, okay. Very good. Okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. 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 Yep. Shoulder, arc. Yes, muscles. Okay, so in the shot turn, I'm bringing on for my foot. And the best one is the one that I'm on you. Make ready! The brown vessel will be for the trigger, even though it's a full arc, just um, to make the finger off the trigger. And we'll just say bang. Yeah. Um, yeah. Try and keep it up, up and down as you can. You've always got the stock sort of point in the Alright, so um, you're always facing the roof. A or present. Um, fire. Bang. Bang. Okay. Um, cover. On. Okay, that brings you pretty much back. Now, just to avoid me having to give any more orders, how about we'll do uh, load as quickly as you can, as accurately as you can, and come back to the shoulder. All right. Okay. So load in your own time. We just. Um, and it's accurately, completely. Say, uh, load your own time. Come back to the shoulder when you are done. Reach one to the Yeah, that's not going to do it. 
Some of the guys actually just, they used to just put out like a leather strap. I don't know what the street is. Maxwell Street. I actually made the point of looking at the street. Yeah, well, there you go. Bit of road. All right, very good. That's not too bad. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a charge, which would be, you know, charge. Ah! God, I'm hoping so, because I usually get dressed up. I've got to explain myself. I did bring my own. Never got a chance all night. Okay. Alright. Yes. It's running, isn't it? It'll be. Yeah. But, um. All right. Horn! Arms! Charge! Ha! People say, Charge, don't use the charm. Not bad. No, we do get to the Shoulder! Arms! They were available to do on Swiss Lake for them if they want to. Boy! Arms! Charge! Ah! Um, so, yeah. Um, so, Ren, you can you figure up to it? Yeah, I guess so. Shoulder! Arms! Alright, fits in with the theme. Good, good, good. Order! Phoenix is making me get knighted this year too. Good boy. They said you have to do that. Dad, Dad, it. Last of 12 years yeah, without it. I laminated the boot today. Oh, well, I laminated the boot. Was, was silly enough. I mean, fortunate emotion. enough to take up my offer. I will also come up at some stage with all my photos from the Tower of London and the Duke of Wellington's ordinary. <laughs> this is a pamphlet. Dad, 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 we actually Especially if you've been loading, you can hear the ramrod wiggling around. Um, 
in the barrel if you left it there, which sometimes happens. So that's one way, and actually some of the manuals, at least in the American manuals for the period, specifically says to slap the musket barrel, um, uh, butt so you can hear right next to you that yeah. that's jingling around because if you lose that round, you're out of luck. Yeah. So, <laughs> so yes, all right, so we're back to the shoulder. So let's do support, arms. Yeah, very good. Yeah. Right. Shoulder, arms. Very nice. And that's that's Okay. Um. And the last one was so it's four arms. And I'll do to fix that. Yeah. Even though not all of us have veins, and any of us have veins, it's okay. We can still go through the motion. So, um. That's what you'll see. Now, fixed veins is typically done from the order on. So we'll go to order. Yeah. Very good. Arms. Carries across. Very good. Now, your bayonet typically resides on your left hand side. So, perhaps this might be a good way. So, you've got your, your the body musket resting just near the outside of your toe. Um, and you're, so, when you fix, you actually bring it slightly forward. It doesn't, it's not very far, not quite that far, just slightly forward. And then bayonets, you actually draw your bayonet, your imaginary bayonet, you turn it around, you fix it. So, and then you know, locking um, mechanism of the slice. So they just slot in basically. They just they they're not as bad as plug bayonets, but they they're not as good as normal plug bayonets. Um, so there's they just literally just go through a guide basically and they they just slot in and then and then you just bring it back. So once it's on there it comes straight back to the order arms. Right? And typically you go through port and just like this. Um walk between arms. <laughs> Alright, so, and then unfixed bayonets is pretty much the unfix, <laughs> slightly forward, bayonets, click, click, back into your bayonet, cross belt, and then you immediately straight back, pretty good. Alright, it's fairly intuitive once you um, get a hand of it. Um, I've just done too many drill manuals, so I'm looking for to keep track of which period I'm in. Um, okay. Uh, it's not really doing doing the first century crusade in the under the Yeah, there is yeah. I, I, went, I, like I went from American Civil War to War of 1812 to Napoleonic War, and so it just keeps getting slower and slower and more and more, and more steps. <laughs> yeah, we'll do it fine. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, yeah, you, I mean, obviously, with, with your work in particular, um, you know, a good understanding of where the center of gravity um, is uh, on these muskets pretty much. You know, like that is generally, that's one thing movies get wrong a lot. Yeah, yeah, or they're all too far Yeah, and actually you'll find it's way more comfortable, especially if you take up this type of work. But you feel that as your hands are behind the swell, you can support it a lot better. Whereas if it's up here, there's not much to grab onto. You can see that they're very cleverly made. This is really the stop. Are they on the where you're supposed to have your So, um, yeah, so you can you also get a good understanding of where the, the center of balance is on the same is obviously. Um, you're loading and firing is pretty much going to be exactly the same as in the military. There wasn't much deviation. Um, French use tin water bottles? Yeah. I'm just trying to think of anything else that might suit you. Well, it's going into it, so. Your arms! 
Shoulder! Court! Shoulder, arms, chickens. All right, well, I think probably the most um, important one, at least for the purposes, yeah, is going to be the loading and firing. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. William so right. Is that um, it? That's all, honestly. Yeah, okay. All right. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. They're legit the okay. Queensland, they're also okay. legit yep. New South Prepare to load. Why did you have a, a reasonable take. reason to own them? Yeah, so you yeah. 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 So guns you yes, you do need a license for just make sure I want to make sure that I've got yeah, one thing to bear in mind in most cases you wouldn't want to do one for and uh shots. Yeah, about the round best the best. Cast bow. Can that very good. Most so goes around and you actually still have that cartridge in your hand. You've got that near the muzzle, but not near the same the muzzle. Uh, charge cartridge! You pour it down and you put the ball in there and everything and draw ramrod. Also baby barrels off. But even with Good. barrels off, um, the, and you have the, the, the point of the ramrod is basically the yeah, just like the yeah, 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 Return ramrod. Yeah, And then shoulder off. Make ready. Solid wood, not plywood. Yeah. And yet, yep. you cock it, not yet. Don't bring it to present yet. So pretty much just straight up and down. Present. Yep, good step back. That's not solid, mate. Fire. Fire. Loading your own time. You'll know what you're going to touch your hand. Yeah. 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 Ye
Yeah. 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 Yeah.